The old laundromat on Riverside Drive between the Santa Clara Hotel Casino and the old Aero Motel burnt on March 15, 2017 in a powerful fire that consumed the entire roof resulting in its falling in. All right, Greg, this is all your baby right here. All right. Okay. That's it. City of Espanola Fire Department, Lieutenant Ron Padilla, said it appeared the fire started from somewhere near the floor of the building and then crept up to the roof, where it rapidly spread across the entire length of the roof. During the laundromat fire, one small explosion startled firefighters, although it was believed to have been caused by an electrical power transformer. Off-duty Espanola firefighter Stephen George heard about the fire and asked what was needed and picked up the department's ladder truck. The truck has a 75-foot ladder on top of it as well as a directional nozzle which puts out large quantities of water. Lieutenant Teresa Martinez of the Espanola Fire Department said firefighters needed so much water because they were unable to get to the seat of the fire or to the very bottom. Because the fire was so hot and the building was unstable, it had to be fought from the top down. She said it was very hard to put out. Everybody worked well together and there was a super fast response from the agencies we requested. A man, who said he was one of the property owners, but refused to give his name, said that they had fire insurance and the building was, at various points in the past, a laundromat, a bar, and a motel, but the structure has not been used for a long time. He said that the only things in the building at this time was washing machines and dryers. There is no word yet from the New Mexico State Fire Marshal's office who is investigating the cause of the fire. 